Hey Jessica, so I'm just doing this video to help you out, hopefully help you get your uh, bank account set up. And so the account, all of our accounts are going to be on the accounting side of things, the chart of accounts, right? So the idea is this, is uh, as we have our chart of accounts in accounting, um, our number one account is cash. Right? And most businesses actually keep all their cash in a bank account. So that's going to be our, our number one account here in real life is kind of our checking account, our bank account. And so uh, there's a couple different ways to get to the chart of accounts. One way is to be over here on the left, chart of accounts right there. Right? You can go into the chart of accounts there. Uh, you can also go up to the uh, gear icon and go into your company chart of accounts here as well. So that's probably the two quickest ways to get to the chart of account. And so what we want to do is we want to uh, follow through and we want to go through from the beginning of chapter two and we want to follow all the steps that it tells us to do, right? So we're going through all the develop your skills Chapter two is kind of unique because the develop your skills in chapter two are with our company, which is our um, Puppy Love Pampered Pooch Company, which is a service company. We provide services for uh, dog owners and uh, right, and do all the dog grooming and all that good stuff. So what we want to do is follow all the steps along the way. Um, one of the things that I noticed when I opened your company, so this is your company, I, as the instructor, right, I can see all the um, companies that students set up. So I, I saw right off the top that your name is not uh, the name that they want you to have on there. So make sure to change that. Of course, in settings, you can go over here under account settings, your company account settings, and you want to make sure to update your company name there. So update your company name and um, switch it to, uh, it's gonna be uh, Puppy Love Pampered Pooch, put a dash and then your name, right? So it's gonna have your name on it. So you wanna make sure to update that. Uh, the quick way to get there is just click on the name and it'll open it up as well. So we wanna make sure to change our company name. Uh, and so, so anyways, that's something that, that you're, you're going to want to try to follow as closely as possible all the develop your skills in chapter two. Once we get to chapter three stuff, the develop your skills in the chapter is with a test company, which is a long, a long keeping company. That one is just to help us practice. That one we're not going to submit work for, but the pampered pooch starting with chapter three, uh, the puppy love company is going to be uh, in the end of the chapter, the reinforce your skills and of course the apply your skills is actually what you're going to be submitting for grades. So anyways, we're, we're in chapter 2 here, 2-3, two and so we want to go to, to the chart of accounts and we want to add your bank account there. So there's a bunch of adjustments that it has you make uh, to this bank account. One is it's actually going to have you um, get rid of the cash account and so and it inactivate so there's a lot of ones that they have you inactivate and you can go here and inactivate that account uh, you can also select several on the side here and then do a batch action and and make things inactive okay so we can do that uh, but really what we're focused on here in 2-3 is we are adding a bank account and so it's going to be uh, we're getting to the chart of accounts. We're going to go up to new, this green button here that says new. We're going to click that button. Okay, so the, the um, again, the, the warning it has on the uh, textbook is, is that QuickBooks Online is constantly changing the look. And so the look here that we get when we go to open a new account is a little different than it has even in the textbook. So... So we're gonna go ahead and select banks, right? And uh, the account we're gonna do is uh, our bank accounts. We're just gonna click that. And then our, uh, here is gonna be a checking account. 
And then the name of the account here is going to be our Los Angeles City Bank. Okay, so that's the, gonna be the setup. And then you're gonna hit save on that and then it'll, it'll save it. And then you'll have your Los Angeles City Bank account in there so you can then do your uh, an original, uh, I think that you said that the problem was in 2-6 you weren't able to put in the, the initial investment. So once you get that set here, then you can go and do the 2-6 and do, do the original investments. So just make sure you're following each line, going through it and, and doing each thing. Uh, if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out and I can send a video or we can do a Zoom call. That's usually good. I'm usually available like Friday mornings. Um, I can Tuesday, Thursday afternoons later. Um, Monday, Monday, Wednesday mornings is usually. Uh, but if you have a specific time that works for you, I can I can work around your schedule. So we will talk to you later. Hopefully this helped. And uh, have fun uh, setting up the books. Talk to you later. Bye.